Hey everybody, it's me, Doc here, with a quick time-saving tip and a little shortcut that you can use to make your Mac experience a little bit better. So, a lot of times you have an application open, uh, maybe something from the web, or just something you need to print and you want to print to PDF because most of us aren't really printing the paper that much anymore. Normally what you would do is press Command P and come down here on the bottom and press Save as a PDF. The dialog box would then open and give you an opportunity to save this as a PDF. I'm going to show you a shortcut. Let's get rid of that. So first thing I do is open up System Preferences. Uh, that shortcut key you just saw me did, that's called Launch Bar. I'll teach you that later. Anyway, in Keyboard Shortcuts, over here on the uh, left side, you want to press Application Shortcuts. Make sure you have the drop-down box for all applications open. Then you're going to press Plus to create a new one. And we're going to do this Save lowercase as capital PDF now you put in the ellipse that doesn't work though you have to use the command I mean uh, option semicolon that ellipse I'm not really sure why it's the only way it works then for keyboard shortcut you're gonna do command P now this would seem to be a conflict with the print dialog but it's not trust me it's some kind of OS 10 secret sauce so let's go ahead and press add and then we can get rid of control panel now back to my document that I wanted to print all I need to do is press command P twice so you hold down the command key while you're holding it hit the P key two times and voila it goes straight to the save as PDF dialog box and I have it set to go ahead and save that now I'm gonna show you again command P P it goes straight up to that and if you want to hit to the desktop you hit command D it'll put it on the desktop and then do PDF test and go ahead and press save and you'll see the document right there on the desktop and if I were to open it it'd be a perfectly nice looking PDF so that's it that was a little quick tip to show you a really cool way to get to something that we use an awful lot now the cool thing about your PDFs is if you have an Evernote account you can store these things in Evernote and then you have an uh, or Dropbox for instance and you have an easy way to find them when you're not at your computer so once again I hope this tip has been of some help to you if you like the video please press the like button feel free to share it and I also ask that you subscribe to the channel so I can keep you up to date with all the cool tips and stuff I can come up with if you have any questions comments or feedback just please let me know and I'll get back to you as soon as possible anyway Aloha I hope you enjoyed the tip